I love a good story. And my favorite stories are ones that tell of God's goodness. This one actually begins in 2013 when one of our Gettysburg Pike neighbors approached Daybreak and asked whether we would be interested in purchasing a small piece of property, just over an acre of land that bordered our church property. We weren't exactly sure how that piece of land would be useful to us, but we felt that God was leading us to purchase it, and so we did. Over the next few years, God provided us with opportunities to partner with the township. One of those opportunities to partner with the township and bless the community was by building a dog park on Daybreak property. And because of that, many new people are now coming onto our campus who otherwise wouldn't have. And even now, we are seeking grants to build a kids park next to the dog park that will be accessible to the kids in our community with special needs. A few chapters later in our story, in the fall of 2019, we entered into Wide Open, a two-year generosity initiative, and God had given us a vision for creating welcoming church homes and maximizing our community impact. We had no idea just how much God had planned for us. A little over a year ago, the story gets even more exciting. We heard about the development plans for the intersection of Route 114 and Gettysburg Pike, including land that borders our church property a development with offices and restaurants, shops and residents, which means our Gettysburg Pike campus would now have a vibrant new community next door. Of course, God knew this was coming long before we did, and we are marveling at his perfect timing as we update our Gettysburg Pike campus this summer. There's more to the story though. I've had the opportunity to build a relationship with the developer of the land located next to our Gettysburg Pike campus. He's a generous guy with a heart to invest in the community. So you can imagine how excited I was to meet with him to see how we could partner together in community investment, because that's our heart as a church too. And he was so excited to hear about the vision that God has given us to meet needs in our community and to bring the hope of Jesus to those who desperately need it. And here's where God's goodness just blows me away. Remember that small plot of land that we purchased eight years ago, even though we were unsure of how it could be used? Well, that is a piece of ground that is strategically important to the developer as it provides needed green space and water retention for the land development plan he's working on. In exchange for that small investment years ago, the developer wanted to partner with Daybreak and offered us the following. He offered to build a road that extends our current driveway along the Route 15 fence line and through his new development, which will provide a second access to Daybreak on Gettysburg Pike. He has also offered additional signage for the church at that new entrance, as well as where the new development connects to the Daybreak property. And because he loved the idea of the walking path that we had planned to install around our entire property, he is planning a walking path around his property and connecting it to ours, and is also taking responsibility to construct a significant portion of that path that will be on our property. And as you may have noticed, we have also benefited from the huge amount of brush and overgrowth clearing that his team has done both along the highway and behind the church as well. For the first time in our 16 years at Gettysburg Pike, Daybreak Church is now visible from Route 15. Well, after prayerfully considering this generous offer, your governing board voted to approve this exchange. But the story doesn't even end there. There's also residential development being built on the south side of our Gettysburg Pike property, just beyond the dog park. And when that developer heard about our plans with the other developer, he wanted to connect their walking path to Daybreaks so that the community that he's planning will also be connected to our church. When all is done, well over a hundred new residences will be connected to Daybreak by this path in the next couple of years. Since every story should have a title, we think this story might be called How the Church That Was Hidden in the Hollow Became the Church in the Center of the Community. We know that God is still writing this story, and you are part of the story that God is writing here as you continue to be generous with your time and your talent and your treasure. You know, God has plans for us that we don't even fully know yet to use us to help people in our community discover and deepen a life-changing relationship with Jesus. Thank you, Daybreak. Thank you for being part of the story that God continues to write through us.